My name is Blake Emanuel. My husband and I live in Phoenixville Borough. We have for the past 10 years. We have two boys, Andrew who's seven and Colin who's 11, first and sixth grades respectively. I work as a special education advocate, meaning that I work with families who have children with disabilities and I help them understand and navigate the public education system. I also serve on two boards, Chester County MH IDD Mental Health and Intellectual Disabilities, which serves youth and adults with disabilities, and Phoenixville Community That Cares, a group that organizes and supports Phoenixville Borough and surrounding areas. I am interested in running for Phoenixville School Board because I'm passionate about public education. My children are first and foremost my motivators. Their education and their future, along with the other children in Phoenixville School District, is without a doubt my greatest motivator. I feel that at the local level we can make significant impact by engaging in the system and I feel that this is one way that I can do so based on my background, knowledge, and understanding of education. I am qualified to run for school board and to serve based on several reasons. First, I have children in the district and I am living what this district looks like every day through my children. My older son has multiple disabilities, so in addition to understanding how the general education works, I have experience in special education as well. I am a special education advocate, which allows me to not only see what special ed programs are being run in other districts, but general ed programs throughout the county. I work in, in Chester County, Montgomery County, Lancaster County, Delaware County, and Philadelphia. So I've seen a multitude of programs, some that work and some that don't work, and can bring that knowledge back to our district. There are a multitude of issues that currently face this district, but I think one of the greatest issues is our growing population. With an increase in development in Phoenixville, East Pikeland, and Schuylkill, we are seeing our student population rise. With that, we need to ensure that we're serving our students who are currently here, in addition to our incoming students, without overburdening our taxpayers.